Yeah, this is wild. No, oh no, oh no. <gasps> Look at the size of those. Whoa. All right, morning everyone. Day six. Here we go, travel day. Uh, the rough day, apparently. Uh, we had friends, they left yesterday and did the road and pretty much said it's rough, it's corrugated, it's rocky, there's dips, there's everything going on this road. And, um, I'm going to run around quickly and here's the first culprit and see what... Steve-o? Morning. Uh, hello. What's going on? Uh, come to see what tyre pressures you run in van and car. Okay, so I've just put down to probably about 24 in the van. PSI in the van. The rear of the car is a bit heavy, but I punched, I was at 30 cold. Now I'm down to 26, and I'll yeah, adjust if it's too heavy because um, I've got the boat. Yeah. yeah. So we'll just see how it goes. Fully loaded. Fully loaded. Yeah, look at this. Yeah. <laughs> so we'll just see how it goes. Um, if I have to put them up, I'll put them up. Put them up. Yeah, nice. All right, and 22 in the front. 22 in the front of the, that's yeah, the, that, to, that's the Ranger. Frank. Yeah. You can always go up. Give it a crack. Yeah, that's it. We've got this real rocky this section. So it's pretty much trial and error. But I, I think I was running. So I think I'm running 26 in the van, uh, 27 in the rear of the vehicle, and 20 and 2 in the front. Um, I went up a bit in the back of the car because it was starting to get a real, it was a bit bouncy the other day. So um, I decided to uh, go up a bit and it feels a lot better now. Here's the second bloke. Morning. Morning, morning. What tyre pressure you running, mate? On both van uh, and cold. Oh, whatever. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, cold. Twenty-eight in the van. I've got twenty-eight on the back and about twenty-six in the front. Twenty-six. Nice. On the big cruiser. Thirty-fives. That thing will eat it up. Here we go, Damo. Morning. Tyre pressures. What are you? I'm watching you yesterday's clip. Oh, at the moment you, while I set up. On. <laughs> what um? What tyre pressures you running? Van and car, do you remember? So on the car, 30 on the, no, 28 on the front, 30 on the back. Yep. Uh, vans, 25 all around. Nice. What about your airbags? You know what they're at? Airbags, uh, 30 PSI. 30, yeah, nice. Yeah. Nice. Same as me. I, I got the airbags at 30. Yeah. Um, I usually run them at 35 on the road. It just feels a bit better, but I've put them down a bit while we're on the corrugation. It just feels, yeah, it just feels that little bit better. Um, we will, um... We have been asked a bit, and I will introduce everyone properly. Um, it's just been, it's been hectic. It's been a hectic, what did I say we're up to? Six, six days? Um, yeah, so we'll head over here and see what uh, Cliff's running in his tyres. Morning. <laughs> oh, morning, Rocco. Cliff. Morning. Tyre pressures, what are you running? Uh, 25 in the front on the car, yeah. 30 in the back. Yeah. And 25 in the van. Nice. Cold. Airbags? Cold. Yeah. Airbags in the MUX. 30. Yeah. 30, 30. Yeah, there you go. There you go. So we're all pretty much running exactly the same, I'd say. Probably the big Land Cruiser's got a bit more air in it because I know, must feel better for him. But this road is the testing one. So we'll see what we bloody, how we go today anyway. But yeah, it's not hard just to pull over if it feels funny and put some more air in or let some air out. Um, we're in no rush today. You know, I can't see us getting over 60 today, so um, it seems to be the sweet spot with the man on the back. 60 seems to handle the car any slower, bumpy as hell, any faster, and you can't even slow down in time for all the washouts. So yeah, probably probably tomorrow. Run around. We'll actually introduce everyone properly, won't we? Um, maybe yeah. not tomorrow. Maybe the next day. All right, next day. Sorry, yeah. I lied. Yeah, yeah. So the next day we'll introduce everyone. Tell you whether we'll go. We'll make up like five questions or something we can ask them and. At least everyone can meet everyone then. Yeah. Um, yeah, so we're just packing up. It's quarter past seven this morning. Um, we're gonna stop, get some fuel out the front. This couple are gonna fill up with water. We've got plenty of water. We've only got one more night and then we're on power and water at Home Valley. So yeah, let's keep packing up, get the car on and yeah, see how this see how this day goes. What's that? Wish us luck. Wish us luck, yeah. Um, it's gonna be um it's gonna be a fun day. Yeah. I'm gonna put the car on and yeah, I think we've got, actually, before I go, we've got a water crossing just up the road. Literally, I think it's 500 metres up the road, so you'll probably see that first. Um, it's meant to be a little, it's not meant to be too deep, a little bit deep. That didn't make any sense. Anyway, it's meant to be <laughs> wheel deep um, and um, soft sand on the out. Are we going to tape up the, well, um, are we going to tape up anything? No, we don't, we don't need to. Because we've got, we're so high, we don't need to. Okay. Yeah, Jordan, who went through yesterday, 
the water went up to his door, but that's because he's lower than us. Oh, mine, Steve's, and I think I seen the other day even Cliff's, I'll have to have a look, is underslung. Okay. Uh, we've got underslung axles. Um, the actual full off-road van, the retreat with the airbags, is actually probably the lowest van, which is crazy. Bye guys, wish us luck. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go. All right, just want to quickly show you, because I know a lot of you mentioned the other day about our coffee machine on our bench. Would you believe it that it's actually never really moved that much? So we normally have, we have this um, TV arm that normally wraps around it. And that kind of does the job. But obviously um, these roads are a little bit different on the Gib. So that one was pretty bad the other day when the coffee machine was moving. But today it's supposed to be really, really bad. So you'll be happy to know we have moved it. We've got our toilet roll and our emergency water over there and we've just stuck it right in there. So hopefully it should be fine. Do you reckon we should take the water out of it? Oh yeah. Oh, you have? Yeah, I took the water out. How good is he? All right, so um, yeah, wish us luck. We're still gonna put the camera in here um, because I'm sure things will still move. So I'd like to still show you what it's like. Oh, I better move these apples. They're not gonna stay there, are they? <laughs> They've got no hope there. Our fridge is looking a little bit emptier, which is quite nice it's not good when um it's so full and you're on these roads all right that'll have to do we're nervous about this road we are nervous oh golly 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 all righty so we're through the water crossing it was deep. Have a look at this. We'll see how they go. Get going, don't stop. Don't slow down. Don't slow down. Don't slow down. Don't slow down. Just beat it. Don't slow down. Don't slow down. Yeah, keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Yeah. There we go. So we took a video before. This crossing here is um, notorious for um, claiming number plates. So back at the station there, there's a whole wall just full of number plates. Oh, sorry, nearly fell over. Yeah, so but we all made it. Let's go and have a look. I'm gonna go see if everyone's got their number plate now. <laughs> that was deep, but yeah, very soft at the end there, the sandy bit. But. Whew. How was that? There we go. How do we go? Here we go. Let's have a look. Yeah, that's where I got up to. So we'll have a nice uh, wet muck mat in there. You got a little door though. Like step down. Yeah, we got a step. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we gotta go slow and work. Look at this dust coming off this truck. Whoa. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, I saw some rocks. Oh. <laughs> wow. Oh, I just got hammered and rocks. Okay, we're about 45 minutes in. Going nowhere, man. <sighs> Feels like we've got nowhere. No, we're sitting on about 60, which is good. Not too bad. Man. Not too bad. Corrugations are definitely there. Um, I hope you can hear me. These corrugations are quite loud. And it's amazing that we've got the guys up front. We've got two in front of us. They can pretty much relay when anything bad is coming so that's great i kind of that's why i like being up front because we've got no dust but uh i like also not finding out first yeah. if there's a dip <laughs> but apparently we've got really bad corrugations coming up so we've got a camera in our caravan and we've put one in Stephen kayla's as well so um i'd like to see how they are going
45 minutes in, we just pulled over. Quick stop. Um, this one's called the Mount Elizabeth Station. See the sign over there? Uh, it is 30 k's that way. We're just stopping it to have a look at everything. Um, let's see what the guys are up to. Nothing? All good? Oh, sweet. All sweet, Cliffy? Just, just a bit of dust. A bit of dust. Good. Uh, you got a headlight that's twisted around over here. His body twisted around a bit. No, I'll put it that way. <laughs> <laughs> Hasn't been too bad so, so far. Good, so good. A little bit of rough spots, but it's just those washouts. They're the only rough things. Uh, yeah, this is so this is Mount Elizabeth. We just stopped to pull up, so you can stop. In, well, it's not that far, really. Like, even if you stop here, then we we'll need to go to Allen Bray. Only because the is that here, the Gibbs Station. Yeah, because the Gibbs Station stays closed. Um, that's why we, we've gone to Allen Bray today. If you stop here, you still got 140k to get to Allen Bray. So, Steve's um, guards will banging around over there. Here he comes. What's going on, mate? If you come here, bring it in, Leah, bring it in. Bring it you in, mate. Get under here, mate. What's happened? Oh, I don't want to get dirty, mate. You oh. can take this if you want. See, what's happened, right? See the guard. It happened the other day. I put a zip ties on for this guard, and um, she just rattles. It's so annoying. So I'm just chucking a couple of tech screws in, and hopefully she'll be all good. Uh, Woo! Oh, maybe after the next corrugations. I think they're going to get worse, mate, to be very fair. I just don't think we've hit the rough part yet. So um, that's coming, I think. She's rough. Uh, we're just gonna um, quickly go in the caravan because Freddie's having an absolute hissy fit and he needs some new toys, I think. She's had fun in here, isn't she? Wow, okay. Little fusion shelf. Oh, it's, oh no, oh no, oh no. Bugger. I forgot to take the soap up. Oh, no. That's all in my oven now. Oh no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I can't believe I forgot to do the fusion locks. Oh, I never forget that. Oh, look, see, look, all this has come off. This comes off a lot. We've got all the screws off here. Oh, we didn't take that again. Oh, we forgot. Oh, what did we even do this morning? Wow. Um, the fridge isn't on. No, it's not on at all. Oh dear, 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 dear. It doesn't matter. It will have to get there. It will, but there's no, there's no power to it at all. To the fridge at all. About now. No. You know that's off. <gasps> oh no. Open it up. Yeah, because it was it closed. It. Go. Okay. Wait. Stop. Yeah. Hmm. <sighs> All right, that's um, not so great about our fridge, is it really? Uh, well, hopefully, it's just... Um, yeah, hopefully it's just the wires coming out somewhere. The next level, just up here, guys. Next level, oh no. <laughs> yeah, copy, we might just slow right down, I think. We're not ready for next level. I think we're ready for next level. Uh, yeah, um, yeah, hopefully it's just a wire in the fridge. We'll have a look when we get there. Everything in the fridge should stay cold. So. Yeah. Well, hopefully, look, if it is broken, worst comes to worst, we've got a fridge in here. We can just take the drinks out and put the stuff in, like cheese and stuff. I don't know what will happen to our freezer stuff. Oh, yeah. I'd say that Clint and Belinda would have a bit of room. Yeah, There's they, only two of them. Fridge, yeah, though. so hopefully it's not the worst case scenario. But um, there you go. That's our first bit of damage. We're done and dusted for the give now. Thank you very much. No more. Thanks. Let's go real <laughs> slow, Damo, because I'll make some Look at the size of those bad boys. Oh, my gosh. They are huge. Oh. I hope this is the worst of it to be very fair because um yeah oh dear that's a caravan on the back of a tow truck it's not good is it Yeah, if you need a crawl.
crawl, crawl, that's what we're doing too. The size of those. Whoa. Yeah, this is wild. All right, we're just stopping again. We're about halfway through. Um, hopefully, we go back in the van and the fridge is turned on again. <laughs> That'd be ideal, wouldn't it? But no, we need to um, fix Freddie up, do his nappy and stuff. That was lovely. Frick. Are you sure that on your no, I, I, we took it off. We took it off. Oh. I, I followed their um, advice. I was like, I know. Do you know you have a coffee machine that's held there by a TV? Clean? I know. Well, it normally is. Uh, normally is fine. Really? Absolutely. Normally just fine. Just the gear, but not. Well, just uh, the corrugation. Well, the yeah. amount of corrugations was just. Um, but everywhere else, normally everything it's is fine. fine. Absolutely. Well, yeah. We just pulled over. Um, there's a bit of a rest stop, a toilet, um, just before the turn off to Wyndham, which is. Um, the way we've got to go to um, Ellen Bray. So, um, oh, someone just said that the grader is on the next bit of road, which I bloody hope so. All right, Freddie, let's get you out and um, let's get your little feet moving, mate. I'm ready, my baby boy. <laughs> You're crazy in the car. You are crazy in the car. He is just, he hates the car. He just screams, screams, screams. There you go. On cue. Oh, I just, I'd. Anyone got any tips? Like, we give him milk, food, he's got an iPad, he's got toys. Um, yeah, what do we do? I don't know. Ride it out. I. Uh, help. <laughs> Please tell me a wire. Did you push a wire in or anything? Or? That doesn't look like it. Oh, no. Okay. Not on? No, not on. He's just dead in the water. Oh. I don't know how to fix it. E. How'd you go, Em? Our microwave is dead. Oh no! Oh, it's come out of its. Yeah, that's what ours does as well. Yep. Yeah. Completely twisted. Oh. So it's all come out yeah. in there. Oh, yeah. There's the wooden frame, and there's our temporary fix. And it's all smushed. Bloody hell. <laughs> and our fridge, one of our, we had a full jar of sun dried tomatoes. Yeah. But, and it's all. Oh, was it an open jar or close? Yeah. Close. Yeah, I know. Corrugations can open up your jars. It is bloody crazy. And they smash your boiled eggs too. Oh no, not a boiled egg. Yes. Well, I heard you're lucky you don't have your pump on because I heard your kitchen tap yes. came. It's all the way on. Oh. And we haven't done anything. So, yeah. Make sure you turn your pumps off, guys, because, um, yeah, it can flood your caravan. Oh, no. Did you come out of it unscathed? Unscathed. Oh, you're good. Oh, brilliant. Is your fridge okay? No. What's it's not working. It's not working at all? No. We tried to see if it, yeah, we tried to see if it was a, a cord, a lead, nothing. A fuse, no. So I reckon it's... Ba-bow. Wow. That's really bad. Yeah. Yeah, just uh, the contents of a freezer fell out. Yeah, that's that's pretty good. Everywhere. Yeah, and same. Yeah, it's next to our fridge on the right hand side as you're yeah. looking at it, down the side of the fridge. That's like the fridge is actually shifted kind of out a little bit. Oh, okay. Just a tiny bit. Out of the whole case, like out of the whole thing. Oh. So could potentially, I don't know. Jeez, look at this. See, you would have saw you would have saw this um, in yesterday's episode. Oh, I think we're buying one. They're bloody handy. done with the uh, rough roads uh, it has been really good um, after that window um, oh, no. not really good I mean it was um, just normal corrugations yeah now we're back on really now we're, the right now we're on really big rocks again and um, corrugations so uh, going a bit more slower Guess who's 
finally gone to sleep when we have one minute to go. Always happens. Bloody children. Oh, I'll let you sleep while you sit down. <laughs> That's right, 100%. Jesus. Go Freddy, go Freddy. <laughs> one minute, literally we just yeah, pulled up yeah, and Freddy went to sleep. Oh wow, there's like, there's a beautiful like garden in there. Beautiful oh, a beautiful garden. garden. Oh. You know what? I'm not taking gardens and grass and anything for granted anymore. <laughs> oh. Well done, team. Well done, everybody. You yeah, well done. We kind of found a cool little spot right down the end of the Ringers campground. Uh, we've got a couple there, one over there. I don't know where Steve and Kayla are. They must still be coming, but other than the fridge, we came out of this unscathed. Um, I've just um, I've just brushed up all of the dirt. That's what I've just got out of that one journey. I don't know where it. I seriously don't know where it comes from. It must be all events. Like it's still. I haven't done this bit of the floor. Like it's a, there's stuff over here. Um, yeah, it's just. I think everything's just got a bit of a brown and orange and red tinge to it. Uh, look under there. I think it's um, like that's yeah. Look, we're not dust free, but it's definitely not the worst we've ever had. We um, are, it used to be a lot worse at Cape York, so um, it's better than what it used to be, but just not dust free. Fridge is still not working, so um, I think TJ might have to watch a, a YouTube video or a couple of YouTube videos and sort of see if he can work it out see if there's something he hasn't done yet to try and fix it if not it's just our car fridge and um yeah so you'll yeah, we'll have to just figure that out and um we'll have to unfortunately drink all the beer that we've got in the fridge tonight <laughs> you're gonna call it was that the worst road we've ever done in australia 100 percent roughest road since we started our journeys oh we thought cape cape york was bad oh, just so that first bit from Manning, that was the worst part. And then when you took a right into Wyndham, that was really good, well, not really good. But it was just good for a while. Like it was still corrugated, but it was just fine. And we thought we kind of had, we'd had it all. And then it got really rocky right before Ellen Bray. So, um, no fridge on? yeah, no fridge is still not working. Definitely? Definitely, no, babe. No. Don't get my hopes up. We're calling it. That was the worst road in Australia that we personally have ever driven. <laughs> and that's crazy to think because they say, they say that right now is the, the gib is the best time to do it because it's getting graded so much and that's what we've heard. But um, if that's good, oh, I don't know what is, um, what I don't know what's bad. Oh my God gosh that would it's just I, I wouldn't do it if that was me if I didn't if it, oh, if it was any worse than that caravan uh, as dusty as ours ours is so bad and that's it oh you've got oh you've got one of them you lucky buggers oh okay and yeah. I haven't even looks like you've been in the countryside great <laughs> <laughs> How's your, how's your dust? Good. Ours is pretty. Oh, that's quite tame compared to mine. Yeah, no, well, and, uh, come see my microwave now. Oh, has it really come out? This is actually snapped. Oh, no, 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 no. Like, oh, that's the whole brackets come oh, out. Yeah. No, so the, we've uh, just done a really rough part really of the gib. I'm stealing the camera, right? My brain is rattled. It was so bad. But we have seen some epic orders. Shout out to this woman over here. She's doing an epic job. <laughs> you can watch that later. I'll watch that later. I'm sure she said she loved me or something. I did, I did. Oh, you did. <laughs> I made them come on the give, apparently. Yes, but it's the best thing I've ever um, done for us. I've said, um, actually, the whole time they're like, oh, Leah, Leah you tricked, tricked us, us into doing it. And I'm like, you wait till the last day. And hopefully, you'll be saying, thank she, God you she made owes us come. Me a dozen eggs. <laughs> Someone owes me a fridge. Someone yeah, owes me a fridge. <laughs> you're, I'm glad you tricked the game. I tricked the game. You can't use that word. I didn't yes, trick. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. I asked. That is the truth. <laughs> Look at that floor. This is swept up already. Is it swept? Oh, stop. That's really swept up. <laughs> but this is really good. Look at this. Oh, no. What have we done? <laughs> Sour cream. Oh, no. Oh, no. 
Was right. that open anyway or not? No. Oh, that wow. Was close. That's that brilliant. was fully closed. Oh, my God. <laughs> this sort of floor just shows it, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh. Look at that. Oh, mine are the same. Yeah, you got like that whole. Oh. The gib, hey? <laughs> Thanks for making us do the giveaway. <laughs> hang on, hang on, hang on. We just talked to it. I didn't trick anyone. No one made anyone. The question was asked and they came along. <laughs> is that straight from the fridge, Steve? I, I don't know what it is. Hang on. <laughs> Hope that's sour cream, mate. I'm not, not sure? Yeah, no, it's sour cream. Any idea? Nah, nothing. No. i have to keep looking. Oh. This isn't good, is it? Got any dust? Got much dust? Not really? Yeah. Oh, it looks all right, doesn't it? The fridge looks around, fell off, that's it. Oh, I think, yeah, I think we've done pretty well today. I think so. Considering. Considering. <laughs> How'd you find those roads, Lise? Pretty bumpy. They are, aren't they? Oh, yeah. are they your worst roads you've ever done? Close One to off, it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, definitely close gosh. to it. Yes, the Cape Cape York was. Cape York, yeah. We thought that was pretty rough at the yeah. end. Yeah. Corrogations, that was the difference. Oh, yeah. and the rocks were a bit bad there at the, yeah. at the end. Yeah. Oh, yeah. we're just gonna have to see what tomorrow's is like because uh -huh. we just don't know if it's the same again or. <laughs> ah! We got away with it though, so far. Just my we fridge. Yeah. Actually, yeah, everyone's unscathed but my fridge. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, we've got some space in the fridge from the car, so I'm gonna see how much we can put in there from our fridge. Otherwise, um, everyone's pretty much got some fridge space for us and freezer space so this is why you're traveling in a group <laughs> all right let me see uh, what i can do you'll be glad to know everyone that i've got room for my sauces in the fridge <laughs> even though uh pretty much nearly everyone was saying yesterday that um uh, they like it in the cupboard, which is, uh, you're very weird, let me just tell you. <laughs> right, I'm in the midst of cleaning. Um, this is the end result. <laughs> There's a little baby toy in there. Um, you know what? I mean, the positive from this is that I can clean my, um, my fridge. It's probably overdue. <laughs> but, um, yeah, that is, um, brilliant. There's some egg everywhere. We broke this shelf today. Just gonna um yeah keep trying to see if we can find some information about the fridge and um, see if we can work it out. But anyway, I'm gonna end the episode off there. So we are at Ellenbury tonight. Um, I'll tell you all about it tomorrow. We are we've got some private baths in the morning. Me and TJ. So um, Kayla and Steve are gonna look after the kids and we're gonna have an hour to ourselves. Oh, that's gonna be amazing. <laughs> so we'll show you that. Uh, we're gonna have their famous um, jam and cream scones in the morning. Um, yeah, and we'll show you around a little bit around there. There's a nice little garden and stuff. And then we're off again tomorrow. And um, we've heard the road is, you know, pretty bad tomorrow again. I don't know if it's gonna be as bad as it today um, or what, we'll have to just find out. But um, yeah, today's road was um, atrocious. And um, yeah, that's, <laughs> that's all I can say about that one. So yeah, make sure if you are loving our videos that you like and subscribe and um, YouTube will tell you when we upload, which at the moment is daily. <laughs> but um, yeah, it will go back to weekly and um, you can keep up with our travels that way. So um, thank you for coming along and um, witnessing, in our opinion, Australia's worst road. <laughs> and um, we'll see you tomorrow and let's hope that um, the fridge is... Uh, the fridge is the most damage we're going to do because um, that's enough for me, really. <laughs> All right, say bye. Yeah.